This is a different Valhalla. This is the real Valhalla. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, I was going to tell you when Greg came, you know the Wagner's opera, famous German opera, is the, the Flight of the Valkyries. Yeah, right. You know the yeah. flight of the Valkyries to Valhalla? Yeah. Right, okay. Right. Would you please call Pastor James H. Slater the third, five one eight seven five eight seven one oh five at home. Daniel, five one eight seven five eight two Now Daniel's house is right there. To oh, the okay. south. Alright. Uh huh. Okay. He's a property owner. His name is Schoonover. Schoonover? Yes. Did you want me to spell that for you? S it's just the way it sounds. S C H. Oh, really? Yeah. All right. Then. Yes. I get no. I've got piles of them. Greg, in that bottom drawer, would you hand every? There's a box, five or six boxes of pens. Uh huh. Underneath. Uh, oh, I beg your pardon. So this Greg. is the homeowner. So he knows what's happening. Uh, yes, he's going to have a copy. S C H. Uh, that's as far as I got it. Thank you. Now, would you, what color would you like to put? Well, is this marker also going to go through? No, this is not. This is washable. Mr. Slater? Whatever. You have your choice. Whatever. What color do you want? Tip it full and I'll pick one up. Right. Okay, I'll take this one this here. Body. <laughs> Okay. I can use black, I don't mind. It won't go be too. Let's go through. It, it does, but it's not enough to make a difference. Well maybe we we have heavier hands. <laughs> my body See, heavy. I can't even look at how it's going through here. Okay. Oh. Did you finish your page, Bob? Might nope. I'll go through the How do you spell yeah. his name? S C H O O N O V E R. Greg, did you get a color pen? You want purple? Do I have one? Schoonover? A schoonover. Marge, five one eight nine two nine one. Marge uh, is his uh, friend. Okay. Would you please go to Village Hall and buy a copy of my okay. death certificate? Would you please make Ten copies on Vesta's copy machine in the Happy House. There it is, right by Greg, see? Yep. Mm -hmm. Would you please call as many trustees as you can? Page one and two. <coughs> trustees. Floor, oh, oh, that's five, page five. Continue, you're doing good. Glendora does not want to go to the hospital. Glendora does not want to go to a nursing home. Glendora wants to die at home, as did her mother and as did her husband. Would you please call Patrice Lyons? Yes. 518-758-8400 or James and Bonnie Dunham. 518-758-6171. No. Greg has met James. Okay. And Bonnie Dunham, and so has George Dixon. Okay. They have met them. Remember, they returned the truck, yes. and Linda has seen them. She right. saw, she saw them from across the street. To transport the articles from the Happy House to the museum, Mary and Tom Kil Kilker. Kilser. Kilser. Uh, you want me to spell it? K. A L C E R. Yes. Five one eight seven five eight six two one five might help along with Mary's twin, Dorothy Kennett. Now, do you folks notice this great big farm as you come down the other end of the street? Okay. You know how you come in the other end of the street and you see this great big farm? That's theirs. Okay. And it goes way, way back to a Dutch patent. Is that where, is that where the, the I think I will pick one of these pens. Is that where the cement, the two cement posts are? Yeah, this one's just a uh, Yes, yes. Is that the entranceway? With the historic markers, the yes. pillars, you know where yes. the pillars are? Yes. That's it. That's it. So and go that's, back there? Yeah, that's historic. That goes way back to the Van Alsteins, and it was given to them by the uh, Dutch government. Okay. And the British government. And that's where Tom Kilser lives? No, Tom Kilser lives here with his wife, Mary. Oh, oh yeah. But Mary is a Kennet, and the Kennets bought the farm 
from the Van Alsteins, because the Van Alsteins couldn't afford to keep it up. Uh -huh. A very sad story, Jim Dunham, whom Greg met and George Dixon met and Linda saw, his father was killed in the World War II when little Jim was only four, two or three years old. You never saw him. Yeah. So that's the Kennets down there. They own that farm, and this is the Kilsers up here. Okay. Now, Mr. Kilser, Tom, is an agrarian. That's somebody who treats the soil and makes things grow better. Hmm. Agrarian. Okay. Load the copy machine and... And I scribbled out of something in order corner, in corner of truck. In passenger oh passenger oh, corner of truck. Corner load DVD of truck. And then load the DVD VHS combo. The combo. Mm -hmm. Okay, so this is how you want it in the truck. Yeah, the way you did it, you rehearsed this. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh George did this. Okay. Right. Yeah. Well, you um, were the packers. He was, he was the packer. You were the carrier. Right. Videotape recorders in driver's corner, low TV monitor, and character generator, same, wrapped in blanket. That's behind you, Walter, the blankets. Right. Blankets. What's that word? Uh, use clothes from the closet, too. You can use jackets like this to wrap them in. Yeah, clothes in the closet. <laughs> yeah. If you <laughs> if you run out of blankets, use clothes from the closet. Put small articles, connectors, power strips in a staples white staples box. Staples white box. Such as you did yes. two weeks ago. Yes. S board gives in Walter's van. File cabinets going back of truck. Desk two. Now this is desk two. This is desk one, this is desk two. Okay. Desk two. Small articles. Small articles into box. Two staples. Two staples. That's those white boxes. So you want two staple boxes, okay? The ones that Walter Desk pulled so expertly. Into Walter's van. File cabinets. Three. Right here. Two drawers. Yeah. Six of them. Mm -hmm. Go into the truck. In the kitchen. Now the only the only thing in the kitchen is the gold. I'll show you where the gold is. There's Franklin's gold watch, and there's several gold wedding bands in here. Okay. That's where the gold is. And there's some more gold. Oh, Greg, would you point out that little tiny chest, red, white, and blue chest in the corner? There's some more gold in there. Okay. Now I got to tell you a terrible thing. When George. Uh, finished the museum. I took him to uh, Dunkin' Donuts at Walmart, and uh, George bought his computer. That's where he bought his computer that day. And then I treated him to coffee. And uh, guess what? When I packed up the napkins, I threw my gold bridge into a napkin. Oh no! Worth about a thousand dollars. You did it, not really. Yeah, it was a gold. It was a gold, all gold bridge. The one that I saw here, that was it was cracked or something. The one yeah. That was broken. Or... Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh! But this was the front part. Oh really? Yeah. So you, it's gone, or you, you think it's gone? And then I went over to my friend Kathy checkout, and I put it in her basket. And then when I got home, I realized it, and that it was gone. They had taken the rubbish out. Oh really? Oh, it was next morning I realized it. Oh really? Oh, oh my goodness. goodness. You know, gold today is yeah. worth something. Yeah. And this thing was how old it is. It went back to 1951. And when wow. I was in Hollywood, everything out there, second thought, no thought, you know, everything's gold. Yeah, mm. gold you know, is it's like not gold plastic, right? it's not silver, it's not this, it's gold. Wow. And I'd had that for 51 years. Oh, oh my how gosh. many years? 58 years? 1951. Yeah, 58 years. Yeah. Wow. I'm so mad at myself. Mm. And when I was at Walmart's Friday doing the monthly shop and I went over to that table, you know, and I just was so disgusted with myself. Mm. But so that piece of gold isn't here. Huh. Mm. Okay, folks. Kitchen, two towels go and red curtain. Uh, two towels I'm talking about. Uh, 
the beach towel to you? Uh -huh. Is it hanging down? The ones that hang in the front, towel. yeah. Okay. And red curtain under covered. The blender, the cross on the wall. That's that one. The mother picture. Okay. Mm -hmm. The mother picture. The, my, this is a picture of my mother. It's a sweet picture. It's over by your the yeah, clock? Yeah, I was out doing a show and she always went with me. Aww. And there she is in that, that picture on the wall. Three. Uh, flags. Three flags. Oh, okay. I see the three flags. One, two, three. One down there is two. And the one, the, two one behind yeah. you, too. The, oh, the one behind you, too? Yes. Is that the three flags? No, she's just talking about the kitchen. Oh, that's the kitchen. Yeah. The one on the microwave, the one over here, the thing, and the one on the wall. Well, I counted that as a flag. I'm sorry. That See that red, white, and blue piece? The, yeah. The one underneath. Okay. The one underneath is yeah. under okay. the Okay. You okay, got it well, on the side, yeah. It's under the small one, okay. you got that one. Right. Okay, piece Greg. Hmm. Okay. Uh -huh. um, three flags. The 20,000 telephone call. 20,000, 20. Right there. That piece of paper right there. Okay. Oh, the sign that says 20,000. Mm -hmm. Okay. And, and, and the gold. And the gold. Mm -hmm. Yes, gold. Yes, and gold. And the box of... And two box of... Super VHS. There's Super VHS, which is different from VHS. It's a higher quality. It's a beautiful picture. It's out of date, though. They don't use it anymore. But here it is. That's a box of Super VHS. Okay. This is disposable. This is just... Uh, Spices. Stuff. Okay. Now, uh, did you, uh, Walter, did you want to read page seven? No, I was going to say she's doing great. Okay. I just read. It's all right. This okay. only got a the pear shaped, Greg, the pear -shaped fruit, fruit ripener? Yes, that's way underneath, and it's a beautiful thing. Okay. Uh, it's like this, and it's shaped like a pear, and it's just right. The lighting is just right, and the air. There's holes in it, and it's just right to ripen fruit. Hmm, okay. It's a nice piece. Um, and the pear shaped fruit. Remainder is bequeathed to Charles Daniel Schoonover, Schoonover and Kelly. And that's Kelly. That's your, that's your letter. Yeah. Who's, who's Kelly? I don't know who Kelly is. Who is Kelly? Is Kelly his friend? No, the other one's his friend. Yeah, his friend is Marge. Oh, who is Kelly? <laughs> he has more Maybe one. he's got another friend you know yeah, you knew about. More one friend. I don't know. I darned if I know who Kelly is. <laughs> so what do we do with that? I don't know. Let me think right now. Who is Kelly? I'll have to get back to you. I'll reserve on that one. I'm sorry. Okay, in the bathroom. Everything stays as is. Let's go look at the bathroom. And is your hats all stay here? No, we no. go to the museum in the boxes. Oh, it doesn't say that anything. Well, we didn't right. get to it yet. Okay. Oh, Kelly is his former wife. Okay. She uh. She just decided she didn't want to be married anymore. Huh. And they have a Is son. that the way it works? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know it was that easy. <laughs> and uh, don't even give it a thought, Walter. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, that's who Kelly is. I haven't been married long enough to just change my mind. Nine, nine last up. week. Okay, so I'm gonna put in parentheses former wife, so we remember that. All right. Okay. I don't I've never seen her much. I've seen her once. But she's the one who did such a great Schoonover. job designing this little apartment. Don't you think oh, it's yeah. well designed? Yes. She did who's such the, a good job. Who's Charles Schoonover? Is he the... the he's a... Uh, you, you, have have you ever owner. met him? He's the one who drives in and out. Yeah, that's... Yeah, I mm -hmm. All right. So. Uh, except the uh, charger battery the charger for the cell phone. That's in there. I keep it in there because I charge it in that outlet up there. Okay, uh, Bar, accept the battery charger for the cell phone. Accept, uh, accept the battery charger for cell phone. 
plant stand. Right here, Bart. Okay. 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 And that's gonna be that's gonna be put into a box and brought to the museum. Well, no. Can you find room for it in the museum? Do you think? What's the battery? How big is the battery charger? Oh, the battery charger is, is this. Something a little bigger. I'm not. Here's the battery charger. I'll show that to you. Everything stained has is and Yes, see, but that doesn't say anything with the hats in the museum. Kelly, excellent. Except the battery charger for a cell phone. Walter, here's the battery charger for the cell phone. Okay. There's a the battery charger for the cell phone. I keep it in the. Yeah, there's the, the summer hats and the winter hats. Right. <laughs> Right. All righty. Okay. Um, what's thirteen? Red, white, and blue plant stand. Red, white. white this blue. is a red, white, and blue plant stand. And lap board go to the museum. And the lap board. See the little lap board. Okay. Okay. Put behind it. Closet. All clothes go to museum. Jackets hang on walls. Jackets hang on the walls. Now there's great big Some nails. Things go into boxes, column 27, 28, 29. Walter, isn't this a dandy times. hammer? Isn't this a nice hammer? What a nice hammer. Wow, wow this, this is a good hammer. Yeah. I wish I had a little one like that. A lady's hammer. Yeah. yeah, I know. I wish I had a little hammer picture or something. I have to That's what it's for. Like. Only a seven ounce hammer. That's a nice hammer. That is a I nice like that hammer. hammer. You can't get... All right, that's what I want for Christmas. Put it on my Christmas list. <laughs> I got it at Walmart if you want to know where it is. All right, yeah. Light duty, seven ounce. That's a perfect hammer. You won't even build it your forearm. Like, <laughs> we use a three pound sledgehammer. I know, that's what I'm going to hang something on the wall. That's what yeah. you need. Yeah. Well, you know, they make one that's only this short. You know. <laughs> and it's eight ounce. Oh, it's a heavier, it's got a shorter handle. That would be a good one. That's and a good you know, one. when they got that idea, somebody broke their the the handle there and they, they just used them. <laughs> yeah. uh, so you go. Why don't they make that? You can hit the nail. Anyway, you uh, folks know where that little tiny red, white, and blue chest is? What it is is over at the museum there's a little tiny chest and it's all red, white, and blue and it's what it really is is cigar boxes. Oh, yes. yes so. My father made that and eventually the cigar boxes gave him cancer, but he did recover from the cancer. But he made, think of all those cigars he smoked. <laughs> and he made that little thing. Well, in that, you will find nails this big, and that's to uh, to hang the coats on, the uh -huh. jackets on, uh -huh. on the wall. Uh -huh. Okay. Jackets hang on the walls. What's that next word? Go to, into boxes, column 27, 28, 29. What? Yes. Uh, on the word? port side, you'll see red, white, and blue boxes, right. and they're all closed, three columns of them. Right. But what's that word that? 27, 28, no, 29, before four. that. The Something word. go into boxes. Column. Column 27. Before that. Keep Jackets going. hang on walls, then the very next word. Something goes into boxes. Vests? No. Vestas. Vests. It's about 20 vests. Okay. Oh. And they're in here. Here, I'll show you two. You stay there, and I'll show you a few vests. There's piles of vests. Okay. Oh, okay. See, Greg. Oh, okay. See, Greg. Yeah. yeah. Okay, vests go into boxes. And if something else does, also. Uh. B. Uh. B. Blouses. Blouses. Uh, that would be these kind of blouses. Button downs. Okay. Okay. Archive box and edit box. Yeah, here's the archive box. Go. The archive box is the re most recent DVDs that have been cable cast. Okay. And, and this is the edit box. Uh, box. Okay. Okay. Then. Go on top of columns in the museum. Do you see those, Greg, honey? Yeah. Yes. Yeah, okay. I see those. Mm -hmm. Oops. Go Lamps. on top of columns in the museum. Okay, just take them, put them on the columns. Okay. Lamps go in boxes on top of column in museum. These kind of lamps. Yeah, yeah. But well, we did mean... put those in boxes when we packed it up. That's wrong. They go in the desk. 
Oh, we had packed them all into a box. Yeah. All the, the lamps are on, on the desk. desk, don't you think? Lamps go in, in box. Oh, no. This is the kind of lamp we're talking about. Whoop, okay. the, uh, don't worry. It's the... Uh, this kind of lamp, honey. These. Oh, oh my goodness. Photography Spotlights. Lamp. Yeah. Wow. See, the, see like that. Yeah, that's for videotaping. Okay. There's two of them in there. That's what it means. Oh, okay. okay. I'm sorry. Carpet. So what are we going to write down? Yeah. Video, video Yeah, video lamps. lamps. You saw those, did you, Greg? Yeah. Uh -huh. Video lamps. This is, though, we're looking in the closet. I'll write That's that good. down to video. Going boxes on top of column and museum. DV cams go into edit box. Uh, DV cams. They're, they're uh, a format that you folks probably have never heard of. It's very specialized. I'll show you what they look like. These are DV cams. So you've probably never seen those. It's a videotape. Mm. That's very, okay. it's a big nuisance is what it is. Okay. Okay. Sweaters go in columns 27, 28, 29, 4. There's sweaters up there. Also. Are, yeah. Sweaters up there. Yeah, everything in there. All the clothes go in 27, 28, and 29. That's right. Um, anything soiled should be laundered before boxed. Okay, bed stand. Empty That's content. this, honey. Okay. Empty contents in a box. Label, same. To top of a column. Yeah, that means put the box on top of the right. column. The little stand is for you folks or Mr. Schoonover, whoever. Bedding or 16 Greg. should be longer. Greg, you like those little drawers, do you? Um, Greg fixed that for me. You know, it came all apart. And you know what he did? The wheels came off. So he, he, on the bottom, and so he just changed the drawers around and put the bottom one on the top and he had wheels again. Ah, he was cool. very smart. Greg can fix anything. <laughs> he go. is very smart. Did you fix the broken heart? <laughs> no, no. I mended mine. Oh. Still mended now. Okay. <laughs> bedding, <coughs> bedding 16 should be laundered. What's that mean? I don't know. Bedding 16. Yeah, 16 that sheets and blankets combined? Or? Yeah, there's a there's oh. a contour sheet under there that and a be made mattress after pad. It goes to the museum. Oh, it means. Oh, it should. I should have said that was paragraph sixteen. See. Yeah. Oh. That's right. That's what I think. That should go back oh. to four. This, this <laughs> All right. Over to here, like that. Bedding. Okay. Bedding. Like bedding should. Yeah. Bedding should be laundered. Bed should be made after it goes to the museum. Bow side. And you see where it goes up at the. All the way. Yeah. All the way. Yeah. Forward. In the bow. Yeah, that's right. Okay, somebody else can read now, page nine. Okay, that's you, Greg. Uh, uh, page nine says, uh, what, garage? Uh, the 17. Uh, what is, does that say? What, patio? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Patio. Patio table stays with Charles. Yeah, that's that folding table that I put on the patio in the summertime to write on. Uh -huh. Patio table stays with Charles. Uh, lawn chairs go to museum. Yeah. Uh, contents of crates go into boxes to be placed on columns in museum. Yeah. Uh, the crates are bequeathed to Charles and as is small table and garage. Uh, kitty litter and... You know the small table in the garage, folks? It's over against the north wall. Yeah. You open the door and it's right there in the left. Little table. Uh, the, the kitty litter and kitty litter pans and, and tray to uh, rescue animals and doghouse to shelter. The doghouse is way back in this corner, folks. It's a huge doghouse. I paid $45 to rescue a cat. And it's way back in this corner of the garage. Okay. And that can go. So that to goes to the rescue shelter. No, it to doesn't. Shelter? No, it doesn't. I think it should shelter stay here in case some cat comes along. Oh, oh, to shelter strays. Okay. Yeah. And, and red curtains are bequeathed to Charles. Yes. Uh huh. And 
this is with the insert uh, uh, 18 of the four four boxes at foot of bed go that's to, to the right of uh, right there. Yep, yeah. where Walter is yep. uh, four boxes at foot of bed go to the columns in museum uh, 19 shoes under the bed in happy house go under the bed in museum uh, 20 the Jackets are, are not to go to cleaners, but are to be hung on nails on walls. Here we are. And the nails are in the little red, white, and blue chest down in the bottom drawer on the left. And the 21 the gasoline jug goes to the museum uh, outdoors. This is uh, the Lincoln's uh, number 22. The Lincoln's go to. Lincoln's go to space uh, opposite Stern. opposite Stern. outside. Uh -huh. Then you have the diagram. Right there. Uh, okay, is that all right? Okay. Is, uh, the, the brush will have to be uh, cleaned, and the iron iron racks and rails will have to be moved away. Yeah, so they, they, they did that one day. They weren't supposed to do that. But the kids come there, and they're hired, and they're two, three weeks they're gone, so they didn't know any better. They filled up the space for the Lincolns. So just move it out. Right. Uh, now our daily bread in the uh, in the bathroom is a bunch of these and they're great devotional. Oh okay, I know what they are. Do you? Yep. Yeah. And they're in here. Okay. That's the one. I'm just gonna devotional. What they look like. They are wonderful. Devotion. Yes, they are good. What's the 25, 26, 27, and 28? That's the colors. Is that the oh. box you want them in? No, that's the paragraphs. When oh. I revised it, I didn't use those paragraphs. Uh, yeah, no. Oh, okay. 24 25, 26, 27. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Okay. okay, I get it. I get you. Our daily bread, uh, what does it say? Devotion. Yeah, devotion. devotional. In Bath, we showed them these bands, of course. Now, Linda, did you want to read? Hmm? Did you want to read page 11, 12? Okay. Number 24. Sweep clean the rugs in the museum and shake the rugs in the happy house. Place happy house rugs on top of museum rugs. Number 30. Two black heaters belong to Daniel. Number 31. Three white heaters go to the museum in boxes. Heaters. Those white heaters are in the garage at the moment. These black heaters belong to Daniel. Okay. But Norma bequeaths her $150 in interest mm -hmm. in the blue sky preserver. Blue sky preserver. That's that, uh, you've seen it, haven't you? The, the copper pipe thing. Oh, okay. You've seen it, have you folks? I haven't. Yeah. It, well, it's out in the South Lawn at the moment. Okay. But what is happening, they're putting so much junk in the sky and what they want to do is to make the sky an electric current and they ionize, they take barium which is a metal that gives up its electrons very easily and therefore makes a current and an electromagnetism. So they want a current Be and uh, in other words they're ionizing our sky and they're putting this toxic barium in our sky and this blue sky preserver deionizes it and after they've gone through with their jets and made this terrible aerosol, then the blue sky preserver will deionize it and punch a hole and you'll have a blue sky. Mm -hmm. And that's what that is. We paid $450 oh. for it. Oh. Okay, so that goes to Dorothy. Dorothy. And, uh, Mary and Dorothy. Mm -hmm. Should be moved to Dorothy's property. Did you know they're twins? Uh -huh. Yes, you wrote that mm -hmm. down. And the trustees, Lenora and Franklin.